Welcome to my channel. I'm Melly. I'm going to be doing a Sims 4 Let's Play with the icon herself, Barbie. With the movie coming out in a few weeks, I thought Barbie would be fun to play and try to get her as skilled and accomplished as possible. And in all my years of playing The Sims, this is the first time I'm recording it. So please bear with me as I'm still learning the settings and getting used to talking. Kelsey Dangerous did a stream creating Barbie in a house for her, which is what I'll be playing with. I did have to make some changes because I don't have custom content or some of the packs, but I would definitely recommend checking Kelsey Dangerous out. She comes out with great content. So this is my Barbie Roberts. I'm starting her off as a teen so I can go through high school with her. And I do want her to have a lot of skills, accomplishments, traits. I'm starting her off with friend of the world, but I'll be switching around different aspirations to get her points and get different rewards. So she's gonna be cheerful and good because those are just characteristics of Barbie. Her likes and dislikes are pretty much set up already. Uh, she likes the colors pink, purple, and blue. She likes pop music. Her characteristics are, you know, all the good type of Sims, good vibe conversations, and she loves all kinds of fashion and loves all the activities because, you know, she's very diverse in what she does. As for her outfits, I did keep some outfits from Kelsey, but otherwise I changed her up a little because she is 18 and of course we're going to be going through her closet and getting more outfits as she gets older and as she, you know, changes up her style. So this is Barbie and yeah, she's super cute. Love her little pink, blue, purple outfits. I'm excited to play with her. So let's get started. This is the house that Kelsey made on her stream as well. I'm obsessed with it. It's super cute. It has this very Malibu Palm Springs Barbie vibe. And I love the decor as well. So we do have an extra room, which was supposed to be for Barbie's sister, which I don't have another sim, but maybe in the future you can have a roommate. And then she has like a sunken living room, bathroom, a little office with like a closet. And then over here, she has the kitchen and her main bedroom where she sleeps. And outside is just like this gorgeous backyard party area with like a bar, grill, seating area, pool, and a little mat for cheer. So yeah, this is what we have in this little neighborhood. I'm really excited to play in this house because it's just so cute and pink. And it's the perfect home for Barbie. It is Barbie's world and we are just living in it. So I did get her set up already. So she has her homework completed. She's ready for cheer practice. It's her first day of high school. And of course, we're going to go along with her. But let's get her ready for school. So we're going to have her use the bathroom and make some breakfast. So she can, you know, spend time making friends and maybe trying to find someone to ask to prom already. Like we can if she gets any crushes we did add people on social bunny that we met so we have a couple of friends already but yeah we're gonna try to accomplish as many of these aspirations as possible that's gonna be like my own little challenge within this gameplay i don't really have like set specific rules but i do want to give her like all these traits and aspirations which that makes sense for her like obviously i wouldn't have her do like the criminal things because just that's just not Barbie's style. And we're gonna try to get her as skilled as possible to get her as many skills up to level 10. And as for careers, I haven't decided yet, but I'm always open to suggestions. If you guys have anything that you want me to try or do, go ahead and comment down below. Okay, and we're about ready to go to school. You have a sim about to go to class. Would you care to join her or should Barbie go alone? Of course, we're gonna join her on her first day of school. Hope she's wearing a cute outfit on her first day. Nice, a very um, summer outfit. Her hot day attire because it is summer, so yeah. It is also really hot where I live. I live in Vegas, so I'm with you there, Barbie. So we're gonna introduce ourselves to the principal. And learn about the new school be like hey i'm barbie i'm gonna be one of your best students tell me more about copperdale high i'm really excited to be a student here so now she needs to claim a locker so we're gonna go ahead and do that it looks like someone already claimed that locker so we'll claim the one next to them maybe we could be friends with this person they have like cute decor 
did he already claim this locker okay let's claim this one then it looks like our enemy noah kane claimed that locker typical we do need to join a t-pose challenge so i guess we have to join him on this to get these points make 10 teen friends and post on social bunny five times okay let's post on social bunny post about orientation say that you're energized you're excited to be here at school first day energy everyone's buzzing about and yeah let's walk to class see who's in your class see if you have any duties barbie chose to sit all the way in the back she did not want any attention from this teacher sophia thinks barbie roberts is swell and wants to become best friends of course and we're gonna say of course to everyone who wants to be best friends with barbie because barbie is just that type of person to have a hundred best friends and she gets along with everyone wants to be friends with every single person even if they have a bad attitude so no kane even though you look like our enemy now we have amazing compatibility so you're gonna be my friend eventually okay and then we have to be friendly with the students so why don't we introduce ourselves to people we don't know friendly introduction to these two and then we can head on over to lunch and talk in the cafeteria okay and then she needs to study for her exams as well so let's study real quick i love that her book is pink for studying for her exams it's very barbie okay so we studied a little bit let's walk on over here and see if there's anyone else that we can introduce ourselves to we can introduce ourselves to her and her other than that barbie pretty much already knows everyone can post on social bunny again you can post about lunch and let's do a happy post lunch is truly the best part of the day so she's introducing herself to other people and making friends first day of high school barbie is killing it so we have class starting again let's make sure she attends class barbie is not one to skip cheerleading for barbie starts in about an hour i might also have her join a side job um let's just get her settled in first and maybe have her first you know significant other barbie impressed her teachers and learned a lot today i'm proud of you barbie let's go home and we can head on over to cheer practice and she's off team practice just before starting practice for the day the team notices that a rival club member has messed with your gear this will really set back practice for the day while the team cleans up the mess and makes arrangements for replacement Barbie feels upset about the audacity of the other team to do something like this. She can get payback by doing the same to them or try to talk things through with the rival team and attempt to make things better. Okay, um, what would Barbie do? I think Barbie would try to make amends because she's just a happy, cheerful person. I don't think she would try to get revenge. I don't know if that would make things better, but let's see. So she made amends and made steps in the right direction with the rival, but not with the team. Ooh, so her team was a little bit upset with her for doing that. Okay, so let's take care of Barbie's needs. She needs to use the bathroom and make herself some dinner. Maybe we can go out and go back to Thrifty, get some food, do our homework there, and see if we run into anyone. So let's use the bathroom first, and we will head on over. Maybe we can invite our two best friends and Alexander Guns is a sim that i downloaded i downloaded a couple of um teams that barbie could run into as potential significant others so let's fight him because we have a pretty high relationship with him already and let's go to thrifty okay everyone's here they're all wearing their like hot wear outfit while barbie is wearing her cheer uniform because you know she just Came back from practice so let's have our sims do homework together and we can also do a little post about cheerleading practice um i mean be a little bit embarrassing since 
you had to deal with the rival and everyone on the team was a little bit upset about that. Okay, not only did I boof the routine, but I'm not even sure what the plural of a pom-pom is. Is it pom-pom? Pom or pom? Pom-poms. Yeah, I usually say pom-poms. Pom-poms. <laughs> what do you guys think? But that's funny. I never really thought about that, but I usually say pom-poms. Okay, so she posted on Social Bunny, and we're going to have her do her homework. We need someone to get to the counter so I can order some food, order some boba. Let's see. We can get a little hamburger slider. That sounds good. And let's talk to everyone. Talk about the cloudy weather. Tell a funny story. Let's talk to our friend over here. Heartfelt compliment. Tell a joke about penguins. Sophia's calling us. Hey Barbie, you've been going through some stuff lately. Do you mind if I come over and stay for a while at your place? I just want to get away from things for a few days. Give myself time to process it. Oh my god, of course, Sophia, you're our best friend. And we have an extra room, why not? Looks like Morgan is talking to Eric over here. They kind of look good together. Do a little matchmaking. There's a guy named Caleb over here that we can introduce ourselves to. Okay, Barbie, go. Go get him. This guy gives, like, Ken energy. He looks like he would be a Ken. Not that I'm trying to get Barbie married already, but he's just a teen. Um, I just want, you know, her to explore her options. Maybe you guys can hit it off. He's wearing pink shoes. Where's he going? Follow him, Barbie. Don't let him get away. He is self-assured and romantic. We love someone who's confident. Let's, like, you know, get to know him, brighten his day, like, tell him something that will make him think about you at night. Ask about his day. Compliment his outfit. I love the pink shoes. Pink is my favorite color. Talk your outfit. I'm a cheerleader. Are you, um, you know? Part of any team. Oh, and he just left. He straight up left in between our conversation. Okay, so that didn't go well, but I mean, it's still early. Okay, let's try to get some food. There is Alexander Guns over here that, you know, we kind of ignored. So let's try to talk to him too, since our relationship with him is a little bit high. Ask about his day. Like, how is your day going? I hope it's going great. I mean, you look great. Tell him an engaging story about your day today. Is she going to make you food or just make 10 bobas for everybody? Maybe you can drink one of these bobas because no one's claiming them. Barbie wouldn't steal, but it looks like they were left behind. Okay, seems like her food is here now. Okay, she is starving. So yes, let's start eating before her needs get any worse. And he is playing in the dirt. For a teenager, he has a lot of tattoos too, but I mean, maybe, you know, they're just drawn on like with marker. Do an impression. Barbie loves making people laugh. He's already in a playful mood. Inside joke. I don't think we finished our homework either. It looks like Alexander is a snob. Okay, I think this is our homework. Yeah, let's try finishing our homework again. Oh, he decided to do his homework with us. This is such a cute little, you know, romantic study date, maybe. Maybe I'm like reaching, but it's cute. Discuss your interests. Her relationship with him is so high. I'm surprised they're not crushing on each other. But you know, they have like a friends to lovers trope, maybe. Wowie, that sim is irresistible. Barbie has a major crush on Alexander. Okay, it's about time she has a crush on somebody. So, she has a crush on him. There's the sentiment. Barbie is crushing hard. And maybe we can, like, do a little flirt just so he knows. Like, we're interested. It's like I'm spying on their little date here. Flirt with him, you know, ask if he's single. Um, maybe compliment his appearance. Like, you're super cute. Exchange numbers. Aww. 
Give him a bolt pickup line because you're confident right now. We have to head home soon. It's already 11. She is exhausted and she still needs to take a bath. Oh, she could already do a first kiss. Okay, we'll save that for like a date. Maybe we'll go on a date tomorrow. I mean, this is a great start. It looks like they're really hitting it off. I love this little study date they're having. So wholesome. It says they're having a steamy exchange. I love it. So cute. Okay, so Barbie has completed her homework. We're going to take her home. We'll see you later, Alexander. She is exhausted and... Yeah, there's no time for romance. Oh, Sophie is here too. So let's welcome her, you know, tell her you're doing okay. She could sleep in this bed over here in the extra room. Okay, so far so good. It's already 7 o'clock and she has to go to school soon. 7.30. Have her use the bathroom. She's probably going to have to um, take lunch. Yes, we're going to join her, and here comes another day at school with Barbie. And it is raining, pouring. Looks like Sophia went to school with us. Post on Social Bunny again. Get you a bestie like Barbie. Legit can't live without them. Thanks, Yuki. And let's talk about our homework, because, you know, we did it with Alexander, so we're pretty confident about that. And why don't we send Alexander a little flirty message? We can send um, some friendly messages out to our friends as well. You know, start everyone with like a little good morning text. Like, hope your day is great. Just like all these messages that everyone's talking about us. I love this outfit. It's like so 80s Barbie. Grab an apple at your locker real quick before you go to class so you're not so starving. Let's get to class. Everyone's so cute in like their little team outfits. Passing notes. Barbie was about to start dozing off when another student passes her a note and points at another student. Barbie didn't even know passing notes was still a thing with social media and phones. Does Barbie continue the note chain or maybe add some changes to the note? I mean, Barbie's pretty funny, so she, you know, would play along and add some changes, but she's also very nice, so she would pass the note along. Looks like everyone likes that she did that. Barbie passes the note to a student next to her and gets a thumbs up from the classmate who passed her the note. Great. Hi, Mrs. Coombs. Nice to meet you. I'm going to be your favorite student. It's scary, yes, but Barbie is dying to talk to her crush. She is missing Alexander. I mean, I wish he did show up at the school, but it's okay. We'll go on a date with him after school. I don't think we have cheerleading practice today. So we'll definitely go on a date with him after school. Okay, so she studied a little bit. Let's get her some food. And then we'll mingle with our little classmates here. Let's do another little social bunny post. Do a book review. Mm, let's do a happy one. She just needs to post one more time and make seven more friends. Alexander Guns thinks Barbie Roberts is swell and wants to become best friends. Of course we can be best friends. Where are you? He is at the school. I wish he did show up at the school. Okay. Stop everything. We have to talk to him. We are hungry though, so we can walk, talk, and eat. Banter with your BFF. Like, what are you doing here? You don't go to this school. You came all the way over here to see me. Give him a compliment. You know, maybe reveal that you have a crush on him. Barbie seems like a person who is, like, very open. First kiss is showing up, but we don't want to do that yet. I want that. I want it to be, like, perfect. Okay, let's not ditch class for a boy, Barbie. We still have to focus on our studies here. And we don't want to be late to class either, so put your booty in the chair. Hopefully, wherever we go for our date, it's not going to be raining, so... We're just going to have to see what location would be best. Maybe something that's also indoors. Color coding can be super helpful when highlighting to differentiate between topics. Luckily, Barbie has enough colors to make her work extra organized should she go for it. Um, yeah, color coded up. Barbie eagerly breaks out all the colors and assigns each one a theme or topic. Her notes have 
never been more organized. She's going to crush the next test. Okay, school is over. Let's see how Barbie did today. She impressed her teachers and learned a lot. Prom is coming up. Okay, so this is my plan. We're going to go home and get ready for our date and then also make like a promposal sign. So we'll be doing all these things. We'll go on a date. We'll have our first kiss. Ask him to prom. Maybe he'll be our boyfriend too. I don't know. It is raining extra hard, but let's create a promposal sign. Looks like Sophia is down. We're going to probably talk to her, cheer her up. I think asking someone to prom is so fun. I love it. Let's cheer up Sophia a little bit. Seems like she's sad. Very sad. I mean, you are standing in the rain. I'm glad you don't think my llama jokes are getting old. I feel like you just get me. Let's help her out. Like, see if we can, you know, cheer her up. Ask her to relax. There you go. Try to cheer her up. So before we even think about boys, we got to cheer up our bestie here. Try to make her feel better. Because that is what Barbie would do. She would not let anyone be sad. There you go. She's very happy now. You should go inside, Sophia. You are soaking wet. But we're going to get Barbie ready for her date. Take a steamy shower. Oh, God. Alexander is calling us. Hey, Barbie. It's me, Alexander. Do you want to go out on a date? Oh, my God. He's already asking us on a date. We didn't have to ask. Okay, why not? Let's go. I was going to ask you on a date, but since you asked first, why not? We didn't really get ready, and his location choice is a bar. We're teenagers, but it's okay. You know, it could be, um, let's put our, ourselves in a group. But it still can be romantic. Like, we can sit down over here and, out of the rain, play some romantic music, maybe. What would be a nice vibe? Some R&B. Okay, so let's... Let's do this. Um, let's get to know him. Like, tell me about yourself. Ask about his day. Like, how was your day at school? I was really happy to see you come to my school. Um, discuss interests. Um, we do need to ask him to prom. Oh, but our prom proposal sign is poor. I don't know if I want to present that if it is poor. Yeah, we might have to redo it. But let's see. We can whisper sweet nothings. What else can we do? We can, you know, ask about his love life. Deep conversation. Like, you know, things can be getting pretty serious between us. They are so cute. What kind of drink can you guys drink? This all looks like alcohol. A cream cola. A root beer float. Yeah, let's order a root beer float. Talk about marriage. That's a little intense, Barbie. Where is he going? Oh, our date little bubble went away. So he straight up is leaving, I believe. Okay, no problem. That's fine. I mean, he did ask us and we didn't have our first kiss yet. I think we need to like work on the promposal sign again. And the weather is pretty bad. It would have been cute if we kissed in the rain, though. Do you wish you looked as happy as I do? Well, you have the power. Just send one simoleon to me. Don't delay. Happiness is just a simoleon away. I mean, Barbie would donate one simoleon. It's only one simoleon and he's nice. Yeah, that's what I'm always going to say. What would Barbie do? Barbie is just always doing like whatever is good in the world. We're going to have to make another promposal sign, girly, because there was no way I was going to present that one. So let's make another one. Oh, and you're making it outside. Perfect. Well, you're scared because you're just making a sign out in the storm. Okay, so it's still poor. Barbie, get your skills up because you need to make better signs. We can't present that to Alexander and expect him to come with us to prom. Okay, she's going to eat a salad because she is starving. She's also really tired. Um, I don't have a coffee machine. Maybe she can take a nap real quick. Okay, one more time. And if this doesn't work, we're going to have to find another way to ask Alexander to prom. Looks like Social Bunny is going crazy. Let's post about travel. Let's. It was a good time. It's a good time hanging out with Alexander. Dude, she does need to do her homework. 
and she needs to get ready for cheer practice tomorrow. Okay, this is the sign. You know, third time's a charm. How is the quality now? Poor, it's still poor. Okay, we're gonna have to figure out another way to ask Alexander to prom. I mean, maybe he'll ask us, you know? Either way, um, I cannot present that to him. I mean, maybe he won't really care. He'll, you know, still wanna go with us, but that's just embarrassing. Okay, we're gonna have her take a little nap and she's gonna work on her home. Probably gonna be so exhausted tomorrow. So we're having her do her homework. Sophia is here. Ask for prom tips like, Sophia, why can't I make a good prom proposal sign? Please help me. Okay, great. It stopped raining so she could practice her little cheer out here. Turn on some S-pop music. She likes that kind of music. Here she is in her little pink cheerleading uniform. Super cute. The weather is better today. Her knees are super low. We're going to have to take care of her right after this. So take a shower, a brisk one. We're going to have to find some food. She's going to have low energy today, but it'll be okay. She'll have all her things done. Okay, school for Barbie starts in about an hour. It looks like she wants to chat with her crush again. So yeah, why don't we send another message to Alexander? Looks like she's not getting along with Wolfgang Munch. Barbie has killer style. Every day is such a look to Kevin. Do another post. Post about preparing for prom. I mean, you're excited about it. Prom is the night I've been waiting for this my entire teen life. Your entire teen life of three days. They were going to have her go alone to school and we'll um, meet back up with her for, you know, cheer practice and for when we try once again to ask Alexander to prom. Should Barbie invite over classmate Ash? You can come over. She is about to pass out and she's also about to go to cheer practice. But her grades are up. She's now a high school B student. And there's her friend Ash that's coming over. Feel free to hang out, ladies, while I'm gone. And there goes her energy. Barbie is... <laughs> Barbie is really um, getting adjusted to this high school life, you know, trying to be an overachiever. She is trying to do it all. But I think I'm going to leave it here for this episode. The next episode, we'll ask Alexander to prom and hopefully he says yes. Maybe he'll be our boyfriend and we'll do all the little prom preparations and go to prom. So that's going to be a fun one. If you guys are enjoying this Let's Play, please subscribe to my channel for future episodes and leave a comment down below of like what you think and if there's any ideas that you want me to do. I'm really excited to play with Barbie and I hope you guys are too. Thank you guys for watching and I hope you guys have a great day. I know it's kind of funny that I'm leaving Barbie like this, but hey, that's high school.